Good morning to all of my amazing boss buddies. I hope you guys are having an amazing, amazing morning, guys. Listen, happy, happy Tuesday. It's really Tuesday today, y'all. For those of you that didn't see my video yesterday, I thought yesterday was Tuesday. But anyway, today is really, really Tuesday. So we are on our way to our first Dollar General Rule. Dollar General Rule. It's a Dollar General Day, y'all. Yes, it is. We out here in these Easter clearance streets trying to see what we can pick up for Mother's Day, guys. We have to have our inventory ready to roll, okay? For those of you that are not familiar selling on the streets, um, the way that it goes for me and the way that it goes for most that sell on the street the day of the day before the day before that is normally very very hectic guys so your stuff is going to be flying off of the table yes it is like a bird it's going to be flying off the table like a bird guys and you are going to need to be able to read up okay you're gonna be able you're gonna need to be able to re-up you're gonna need to be able to replenish your stock okay and we don't want to go home just because we've sold out guys we want to have product there so that we can keep going and keep going and keep going right so let me give you guys some pointers for those of you that are new okay so at the end if you start to run out you're not going to be able to make but so many baskets at one time okay it's going to take time to make baskets but if you still want to get your money honey all you got to do is get you some gift bags i'm giving you some pointers okay some ideas it's quite a few things you can do but you can get you some gift bags and you can put some gift items in those bags. It don't take but a few seconds, baby. You can hire you a little bit of help, pay them a couple dollars an hour, and get them to just throw it in the bag. Oh, throw it in the bag, y'all. That's all I gotta do is take the, um, you can get maybe some body wash. Um, you can even use chocolates then if you're gonna be doing it right then and it's not going to have to see it because if you're gonna be outside, the temperature probably isn't gonna be favorable for chocolates, okay? But you could use a type of candy or a type of candy like I have in quite a few of my baskets, which is the almond roca, okay? Now, I'm not telling y'all to go out and buy almond roca because I don't know how much almond roca costs. I think it's a little pricey, but boo, I got mine for free, okay? So you didn't think I was going to put them in those Mother's Day baskets and being that it's a hard type of candy and it's not going to melt. Honey, they sitting right in some of those baskets. But if you don't have that, you can use a type of chocolate if you're going to be selling it right then. Or you can have your little cooler with your chocolates in it, okay? You can, let's give, let me give y'all another idea. So, okay, we got the gift bag idea, whatever. You don't have to use the chocolates. X the chocolates out. You can do a small bear. You can do a body wash, a body scrub. You can do a bath sponge. Think of cheap items okay or inexpensive items we don't like to use the word cheap it gets a negative connotation but we want to get inexpensive items okay and put them in the bag guys put you some gift tissue on top and send them on their merry way okay then another thing that you can do is you can do some unbaskets guys right on site wherever you are you can do some unbaskets and that is if you have access to electricity okay if you have access to electricity um then i would recommend the unbaskets i like to shrink wrap unbaskets okay that way things don't move if it's going to be on a platter you don't want things rolling and moving all around and when the people get the stuff it's falling all over Mm -mm. We boss buddies. We don't sell like that. So if you got access to electricity, then you can plug up your hair dryer, your heat gun, and zoom, 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 zoom. Send them on out the door, right? So there are quite a few things that you can do, you guys. You can do just a bear in a mug, okay? A bear in a mug and stick a, a, a bar of Dove soap on it. Two items. Bam. Wrap it up. Put it in a silo bag 
and you are done, guys. Think of some quick and easy ways that you can keep the money flow going without having to go home and try to, you know what I'm saying? Unless you are a pro, okay? If you are a pro and you've been doing it for years and years and years like me and many other people, then you can make baskets like that, okay? So if you can do that, then do that. But my thing is, baby, do whatever you got to do to get your money and keep your customers coming back. I hate to tell people I don't have no more. Honey, you do not and will not hear those words coming out of my mouth until I just can't take it no more. And that's going to be on Mother's Day evening, okay? Or Mother's Day night. I go until the money stops. And wherever the money resides, that's where Boss Lady Fee resides. Okay, guys, so I am at my first, first dollar general. Yes, guys, I'm at my first dollar general hype. Ready to see what I can get. See you guys in the next video. So this is what the first store got, y'all. And they do have quite a bit of stuff. But we're not about to pay no 70% off for stuff like this. When it's going to be still sitting here next week. Okay. But I did find me some baskets. So I wanted to show you some of the things to be looking for. Y'all, look at this beautiful, beautiful canvas. It was $10, which I think it should have been more than that to start with. I definitely got that. It was really, really large. If it wasn't already worth more than $10, I definitely wouldn't have bought it. I would have let it sit there to 90% because it was actually lost anyway. But um, then I also picked up these baskets. Not lost. It was hidden. I'm sorry someone was coming up and took my concentration but um yeah it was hidden so i would have actually let that sit there but i went ahead and got it and these are the baskets guys that are 70 percent off as well so these are ringing up 150 for the smaller ones that's all they had and these candles right here they are not ringing up but ask the manager or whoever's at the store if they'll override it for you if i can get them out bro because they are definitely Easter. Give me a minute, y'all. Sorry. They are definitely Easter. Happy Easter. Okay? But for some reason, they're still ringing up half. I mean, full price. So make sure you ask them about doing that. Okay? All right, guys. I will see you. I don't know if I'll record it the next video. I may go ahead and upload so that you guys will go ahead and know what to be looking for. All right. But if not, I'll give you all a video of the full haul later today. Okay, y'all. So I know I'm supposed to have been um, ended this video. But I wanted to give you guys a heads up because this is the second store that I've been in. For some reason, most of the, not all, but most of the decoration part of Easter is ringing up full price like the purple vases with the little pink uh, flower on it is still ringing up full price the candles are still ringing up full price um but certain stores will adjust certain ones won't you just ask okay if they can't okay keep it on your shelf honey and let it keep collecting dust but if they will um they will um do it then hey get it and go so this is one store I just left from. Um, she wasn't willing to adjust it, although it had Easter on it, um, as clear as day. But anyway, she was like, if her manager was there, she could do it. She would. She can do it if she wanted to. I guarantee you, if she wanted to do it for herself or somebody she knew, she would have done. It. But anyway, so yeah. So just be aware of that, you know, because I didn't want you to get to the store and be like, she got me all the way at these Dollar Generals and this stuff is not ringing up. I've had no problems with any of the baskets, which boo is really what I'm looking for. Um, the other stuff is just going to be an added bonus. <coughs> so anyway, be aware. Okay. Now for real, I'm going to end this video. Goodbye. All right.